Another season has gone by in the 2013-14 America East academic year, and five more conference champions have been crowned. The Albany Great Danes made a big charge up the Commissioner's Cup standings, winning four of the five winter championships and totaling 128 points. The University of New Hampshire held on to a slim one-point lead in the Commissioner's Cup standings, winning the Women's Swimming and Diving Championship and finishing third in women's basketball, their highest finish since the 2004-05 season. Albany captured championships in both men's and women's indoor track and field and men's and women's basketball. UNH won its second straight women's swimming and diving title and sixth overall, holding an America East Championship record 877 points at the meet held at WPI in February. The Wildcats collected eight individual victories and won four of the five relay events. Albany swept the men's and women's indoor track and field titles for the second straight year. On the men's side, it was the ninth in a row for the Great Danes, who totaled 219 points behind some tremendous depth. Alexander Bowen won the high jump and went on to be named an All-American at the NCAA Championship. The women's side totaled 198 and a half points to win their fourth America East title in five years. Sylvia Delfava collected a pair of victories in distance events, while Ayana James and Michelle Anthony also had event wins. Albany captured the men's basketball title for the second straight season as the number four seed and became the first repeat champion in seven years. The Great Danes defeated Mount St. Mary's in the NCAA first round, the eighth NCAA tournament win in America East history. Albany's season ended with a hard-fought game against top-seeded Florida. The Albany women's basketball team became just the fourth program in conference history to win three straight America East titles, defeating Stony Brook 70-46 in the America East title game. The Great Danes earned a number 15 seed in the NCAA tournament, where they fell to number two West Virginia, but not before setting a program record with 28 victories. With the winter championships wrapped up, UNH maintains a 235-234 lead over Albany. The Commissioner's Cup annually recognizes the strongest America East athletic program, taking into account both regular season and championship success.